Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome to the channel if it is your first time here around here. I am out in Lincoln today with News Now Yorkshire just over the way. Now we're at the second station of the day, this is Highcom, Highcom station and again it's another little tiny house thing. What is it with the Lincolnshire and police stations and tiny little house things? Second one I've been so let's go check it out. Yeah, we've got, so here we go, we've got police cars here, we've got another police car there. But look at that, that's the station again. Another tiny little thing, it's, it's strange. Right next to like residential properties as well. It really doesn't make a lot of sense. So it says that North Highcombe Police Office, not a um, station, but still. How secure is your home? Closed crime. Little gun thing there. Neighbourhood police and teams high town and rural area based at this station and details your local policing team along with helpful information about crime and policing in your area can be found on the internet at police.uk. Town inquiry office opens 10am to 2pm Monday to Friday. The station is staffed 24 hours. Hey, this station is staffed 24 hours. However, the officers may be out dealing with an incident. There's your phone that you can use to ring 101 should you need to. So it is 24 hour manned. Um, because there's cars here, I would maybe assume that there is somebody in there, maybe. But again guys, nothing, there is nothing to see here. It is just mental, absolutely dead. It seems to have a backyard over here as well. Look. Oh, it's closed off, is that door? It's all sealed off. It's not a door, it was a door, but not anymore. It's fully sealed off. Absolutely nothing to see at all. Bonkers, absolutely bonkers. I tell you what, they're not in Leeds here. Look at that. Even leaving Tom Tom's in window. If that were Leeds, that'd have been robbed by now. <laughs> Tom leaving sat navs in window. I thought no one does that these days. So there, guys, absolutely nothing to see. It's really dull. And it's right next to residential houses as well, so I want to be really careful and not be putting, you know, people's houses on. Oh, there's a Tom Tom in the sat nav in this car as well, just left there. Nothing to see here, guys. Nothing to see here. Absolutely dull. Boring. Well, they like the little stations here, don't they? Absolutely bonkers. Ridiculous. I get the full police station. Look, I get the full station in one shot. Like, what the heck? Mental. Well, dull as guys. There's no inquiry desk or anything like that, so we can't get inside. Boring. Serving since 1955. Oh, is that what it used to look like? We've got some officers here, so we've got um, Community Beat Managers, PC Mark Wood, and we've got two PCSOs, we've got Penny Linden and Julie Clark. Whoa, they, well, hang on, they've got mobile numbers for them, mate. Mate, they've got mobile numbers for them. That is a different one for me. That is a new one on me. Wouldn't you get bloody prank called all the time? Oh, we've got some different ones over here as well. We've got Sarah Lingard and Joe Mackey. They've got phone numbers, man, mobile phone numbers. Can you imagine, can you imagine doing that? You'd, you'd get a million prank calls, would you not? Well, if anyone gets bored tonight, I know how you can cheer yourself up a little bit. <laughs> Well guys, there you go, that was a little quick nothing, but I showed you the station, you might not have seen it, and um, first time I've ever seen police, PCSO's phone numbers and officers' phone numbers put on display outside the station. Obviously there'll be work phones, won't be personal phones, but still, I'd be ringing that all day long if I was still 14 years old, do you know what I mean? Oh well guys, anyway, might not have been an exciting one, but still I hope you enjoyed it, until the next one as always guys, stay safe, peace and respect.